Hello, I'm Richard Ridge for Broadway World. Following a critically acclaimed sold-out run at New York Theatre Workshop, Heidi Schreck's new play, What the Constitution Means to Me, which is directed by Oliver Butler, has come to Broadway's Helen Hayes Theatre. And I caught up with Heidi just minutes after the opening night curtain rang down. How does it feel? Uh, it feels surreal. I, I, no, I'm so thrilled to be here, but this is not where I expected this show to end up. And so I kind of feel like I'm living on another planet right now. What an incredible <laughs> journey you've taken with this show, right? Yes. Yeah. It, I mean, it started, I really started making it for myself and I um, did it with the great Club Thumb downtown thinking I'll do this for nine days. I'll get it out of my system, I'll work out whatever it is I'm grappling with, and then I can move on. And uh, the, immediately, even, even downtown, that first nine days, the response has been, was so overwhelming um, that the show is just, seems to continue to find uh, an audience of people who, who maybe need it. I don't know, maybe, they, maybe we all just need this conversation right now. Heidi recreates these speeches that she gave as a teenager. She put herself through college giving speeches on the Constitution, and she recreates those speeches. Uh, four generations of women in uh, on one side of her family had uh, domestic violence in their families, and she's the first woman on that side of her family to grow up in a home free from domestic violence. And she tells a story about how the women in her family were and were not protected by the Constitution um, over many, many years. Um, and then in addition, she debates a teenager on stage about an existential question, should we abolish the Constitution or should we keep it, um, as a way to sort of figure out, you know, is radical change or incremental change the way to make any sort of change in our world. When we were workshopping the show, um, we would do on the feet debates and we would get topics and we would have to just anything that comes out your mouth that defends your point just say it right and th that's when we get the most interesting the most fun things out of each and every one and I think that's the most that's the best that's the best because at the end of the show of course you you debate either someone either Heidi or you or decide if you're gonna abolish or keep the Constitution and I mean just like listening to the audience what that means to you um I mean it's funny because I used to before, I always loved being opposition. I was always like, we need to keep this document, this document protects me. But then after starting Broadway, we decided to switch it up and do proposition, where I actually argued to abolish the Constitution. And now I'm like, this document does not protect me, right? And so I think every night when the audience gets to decide like who, whether we should keep or abolish the, the Constitution, it's like I want to ask them, like, why, why, why do you think we should keep? Why do you think we should abolish, right? And then when the audience like responds to that one person, that gets to choose whether we keep or abolish, it's like, <laughs> yeah. What I love about Broadway is it's like, it's, it's Main Street USA. It really is. Like, the people who are coming to see the show, which downtown is wonderful. I love downtown. I would never trade that experience for anything. But when you're at Broadway, you have no idea who's coming to see the show. It's wonderful. Talk about sharing the stage with Heidi and what this whole experience has been like for you. It's been exquisite she's so generous she brought me into the show I I, I I like to tell people I'm part of the I'm part of the frame of the show like I'm both like maybe one of the guys on the walls and like somebody just said maybe I'm like her support dog <laughs> you know what I mean so but be getting to be with her and you know it's like very real it's like it, Heidi's very real like what she goes through to, to do the show she goes through a lot of feelings, and thank God, because we're not doing a show about like math or something, which is not to say math doesn't have a lot of feelings, just that like, you know, it's like, she has to, she's riding a whole bunch of different waves and I go with her. And the fact that she trusts me enough to do that is amazing. Everybody should know the Constitution, what our country, like the foundation of our country, its problems, its flaws, the thing that's good, the, I, yeah, you guys should study the Constitution, yeah. I got my little blue book, I started last night. Oh, I'm reading it. Don't you worry about a thing. When you took your bow tonight, what were you thinking? I was really excited. I was just like, oh my God, Roselli, you're here. You're on Broadway. This is kind of exciting. And then I don't actually think I'm on Broadway until I actually leave the stage and I'm just like, girl, you did a really good job. This is like really exciting. Woo! 